EFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Monday, the 17th of June. We're looking at the 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow's down 108. Gosh, every day. Down 108, 38,481. I'll talk about this candle when we get back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Chapman, we've Roman candle. But in the meantime, back at the ranch, the S&P is a little bit weaker, not much. But it's down five and a quarter at 54.26, so close to the 54.47.25 all-time high. We're looking at the uh, QQQ. The QQQ is at an all-time high as we speak, 479.20. The SMHs did make an all-time high and then pull back a little bit, but they're still up $1.13 at 269.08. IWA on the Russell 2000. <clears throat> A uh, week again down 49 cents at 198.23. What we're looking at is gold. Try to rally and then it fails. It's down 14 at 23.34. Remember that nine period moving average below the 14 is always a sign of weakness. And that's what we've got. We've got the dollar doing exactly the opposite and went green, the nine period moving average. So it's unchanged right here at 105.54. Eight legs sees doing quite nicely. Uh, let's go to the bonds. Bonds are down huge, down over a quarter of a point, 1.4 and 4.30 seconds. This is not good. It means yields are back up again. But it's it's trading right on the Chapman Wave inside track. Was a repellent zone, became a propellant zone. Wow, now we're stuck right on that line. Got to watch it really closely. Let's go to crude oil. Crude oil is up a little, up 56 cents at 78.62. So with that said, what we're looking at here is is this going to be the week where we start to see the semiconductors start to pull back? Maybe even the, the Dow starts to find a little bit of support. Wouldn't that be interesting? And maybe even the IWM. Is there going to be a rotational correction or is this going to just continue? I'm a little concerned because the IAI, which is the broker-dealer ETF, keeps coming down. Uh, not a big deal, but it is making lower lows and lower highs. And that's just a sign of a, tr a trend change. So we're going to be watching this very closely. So we're coming back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. There's a tremendous amount to discuss. We've raised cash. We are in short positions. We'll see if that's going to work out. But that's what the technicals have said to us. We'll be back in a moment. Basil Chapman, Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call, Daily Newsletter. See you in a few minutes.